whatever you would normally do to protect yourself. Mm. Pour the water, sage, mm -hmm. have some salts. Yeah, because I feel like it's not over. Yeah. Because he's a, he's touched you. It's a part of you in some way. Yeah. And so I feel like you need to get it out of you, cleanse it off of you beyond what we've done because he literally put marks in your skin. Yeah. Yeah, when we were at the hole, um, it, it felt like when when we were using the sage, I was right at the edge, right by the edge of the hole. But my foot was right by it, and I could feel the fingers like grab my leg, around my leg. And then whenever I lifted my pants up, I had the red marks on my leg. And um, now I'm, I started having pain in my side over here too. So I don't know, you know, how bad it affected me, but yeah, it wasn't good. I didn't feel it was good, and I just felt like it was only... It It's so strange how things can be affecting you and then when people pray on you and help cleanse you the way you automatically physically feel. I was having a lot of pain in my side and since we used the Did your head just I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to say that. Your hat just moved. It did. I, I saw it I'm move. Not touching it, see? I There's saw it. Your, no, you your hat literally it moved. It scooched back. back about. And I'm not touching. Ooh. Nobody touched it. <laughs> it moved back a couple of times. I ruined it. No, it, no. it went. It went like this. It went. Yeah. I promise. Uh, yeah. I'm like at least an inch or two. It moved. It, moved it, it, back. Promise it you, went from it this moved. to. Yeah. Just and like and that. I was not touching it. You were not touching it. We were nowhere near. It just Did you put there. oil on your hat? No. No. It's moving away from him. He's got the oil on him. Okay.